Hey guys, welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. We're gonna keep going with the Broken Sky, which means we have to head north to Stonecrest and meet up with Catalo. I'm super excited. I've been looking forward to getting to the mountainous area up in Yosemite for quite some time now. Uh, so let's just trek north. Probably gonna run into a few points of interest and new machines, hopefully, too. One thing, actually, the second verse is on the way. I'm not sure if we should do it because I think what we have to do is kill some Grimhorns, right? It might take a little bit of time. I could get a mount. Nah, let's not get a mount. I think I'm gonna... Let's see when we get there. I might skip it for now just because I'm really feeling this main quest right now. And it's a bit of a trek to get to Stonecrest. I love that we uh, we did the Frozen Wilds die on this armor just randomly. But it's fitting now because we are going up to the north. Oh! Oh, Vista Point Tower. Okay, nice. Yeah, I bet you they, uh, they peppered a lot of points of interest along this road because most players would take it for this quest. Let's, uh, let's do this really quick. It's probably for, uh, Memorial Grove, right? This is where Zoe said we'd find the Grimhorns she needs parts from to heal Plainsong's land gods. I should let her know I'm here. Okay, we gotta call her. Let's uh let's do this and then see where we're at. Images of the old world. Looks like a plane hmm. with some kind of metal structure. Um Looks like a radar dish or something, right? And mountains. Would the mountains be It's it's the Memorial Grove, right? So Like, that's gotta be it, right? We can't climb this, right? Yeah, we need to get higher somewhere. The Grimhorns that Zoe wanted to harvest should be somewhere nearby. I should let her know Could that be it? That's kind of far, though, right? Is there a plane down there? Let's let's go up to that, because that might actually be it. Good use of this. Oh, I just missed some salmon. Shoot. Are we still on? Yep, yep. Okay, no, it's totally this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. We can climb. It's within our abilities, I'm sure. Okay, almost there. So this looks like, yeah, no, this is totally it. That metal structure looks like the one in the end. There it is. Cool. Wow, what a difference, right? No jungle, flat. Wow. It's, yeah, very interesting. You can kind of see the curved area. I think that's the arena now. I wonder what it was beforehand. Let's see. I just want to check the uh, the thing we got. Come on. I forget. Are they not here? Hmm. Oh, collectibles, right? Yes. That's it. The Memorial Grove. Yeah. Scrub fallout from the crater zone. Oh, I... Can we find that crater? That'd be really cool. I love fallout. <laughs> Not literally, but... Hmm, interesting. Is the arena the crater? That would be funny. I doubt it. No, there's no way. <laughs> okay. What do we got here? Bellabax? I think we're gonna skip Zoe for now. We're just probably gonna do the whole second verse quest in one, uh... You're not gonna take on those grim horns without me, are you? Oh, you're here. Good. Taking these machines down won't be easy. We're doing it, I guess. We'll be fine. <laughs> Follow Shit. my lead, okay? Okay, sure, sure. Uh, okay, are there grim horns then? 
Ah, uh, right there. there. Apex Grimhorn. The okay. And they're not alone. You'll just have to be smart. I kind of want to eliminate this guy first. No, don't call your friends. You're fine. Oh, shoot. No, they're already engaged. Oh, everyone's here for the party. Okay, that was so much for stealth. Shoot. Okay, let's pop his thing. Hit the Grim Horn in it. Nope, did not get the Grim Horn in it. That's okay. Just about, actually. See if we can pepper him with some arrows. Nice. Right, these guys are like mini thunder jaws. They got the launchers. Ah, it's a fellow back. One. Oof. Someone's attacking. Okay, let's get some distance here. What the heck was that? Oh, missed. He should die now, hopefully. He's down. Okay, let's get that off. This Bellaback is being inconvenient. Come on. Oh. I could use my Valor Surge, actually. Let's do that. Let's get out of here, and then... I have Heartbreaker activated, and I actually upgraded it all the way because it was helping me uh, with uh, getting machine parts for upgrades. Okay, now Heartbreak. Go, go, go. Don't got a lot of time on this. Come on. Right, let's get this guy then. Yeah, they're just popping off now. Shoot. Too much stuff everywhere. My Valor Surge is up. Uh, well, we made use of it. This is gonna hurt me. Where, where were the, I got one launcher off, right? Where was that? Right here. Oh, those are cool. They like split off. That's awesome. He's dead. Fire's not. Fire's not where it's at. Caught it? Ah, didn't catch it. Ow. 
Ow. This guy's almost down, so... Ooh, I'm out of... I'm out of healing! Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, that was really close. <laughs> I think this is the upgrade resource, right? So I want it off, yeah. It was, so Good job. Okay, that's one. That Sky Drifter is still alive. I hate that. We're gonna kill him next. I'm barely alive. Okay. Oh my god, stop. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I do have my terror arrows. I should use those. They're just... I didn't realize they were so expensive to make. Oh, they're so good, though. Yeah, no, it's worth it. Everything just, like, flew off. <laughs> so good. Let's get that. No, don't climb. Don't climb. No, Aloy! <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> no. Gorilla, I appreciate all of the mobility options here, but also no. Ow. I really like Grimhorns. I think we can find s I hope we can find some more out in the wild just to fight. Right, big finisher. Okay. I think our battle is done. We did it. Yeah. You okay? A bit winded, but I'll tell you. That got a lot more chaotic than I expected. Well, we didn't really have a good spot, uh, good start, so. Uh, there's a storm. You know, I hope for the sake of the inhabitants of this world that we fix the storms, but I really like them atmospherically and I kind of don't want them to go. Does that make me a bad person? Maybe. But I wonder if we fix, uh, if we fix ether, if they'll just stop. Or maybe just less frequent? I don't know. Control cores as requested. Thank you. Gaia showed me a way to scan them and take what we need to update the reboot code. I'll head back to base and get started. When I was a child, there was always enough to eat. The land gods provided for us, and every season we celebrated them. My happiest memories come from those times. <laughs> Do you really think we can bring them back? We'll make it happen. Thank you, Aloy. I really like Zo and the Utaru in general. After we finish um, Ether, I think we should do that next. I'm really excited to see what happens. I should do something else in the meantime. And uh, we did come across multiple land gods in uh, just around uh, No Man's Land, and I, I wondered if it was going to be part of a quest or not. One of them is just buried in a lake, which is so sad. Thunderjaw- there are a lot of Thunderjaw sites in this game. Not complaining, but... You'd think they'd keep that for, like, a uh, one of the new machines. Yes. 
Yeah, there he is. Nice. Okay, let's keep going. Is that old world? How is that still standing? You know what? I never do mount. Let's do mounted. I like that she calls him buddy. Because accurate. I just want to see, can I get a scan in here? Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything super interesting. But I always love some ruins in uh, in the open world. It makes it feel more... I don't know. More lived in, in a way, but they're ruins, so not quite. I mean, if you think about it, during the time of the old ones, there was shit everywhere, so... Th there should be ruins peppered in and around. Speaking of which... More relic ruins. I haven't done any relic ruins since the uh, the start of the game. I'm thinking I might do a stream at some point for uh, for those. Shelter. Chance to rest. Check my gear. And uh, someone here with us. Cool. I like that. You there. Over here. You're the champion. Come from out east. He must be Sky Clan. Look at the colors. My people owe you a debt, so I'll share what I know of this land with you. Beautiful backdrop, too. I see in here that might help you in your travels. For example, did you know that wherever you go in the clan lands, you'll find places where the Ten left their mark? There's an ancient tower north of this. I've heard rumors that relics have been sighted there. Ah, uh, but a relic ruin. Maybe I'll have a look. That's the spirit. Runner's Wild. Yeah, so I was thinking the uh, the Sky Clan would have like hues of blue, right? But it looks like there's some purple there too. Ah, oh, I love the color. That's amazing. Let's uh let's restock, I guess, and then I actually managed to already upgrade the tear bow fully, so we don't need to do that right now. I need to find rollerbacks. So when we were exploring, there were rollerbacks up here. Um, it wasn't a sight though, because I've been there since and I haven't seen them again. Hopefully we will find some. What's this say? Stonecrest? Yes. Maybe I should look around for a focus. Any camp? Which camp? Oh, I love this track. I think it's, um, no footfalls to follow. It's beautiful. Where was that camp? I didn't see it. Also, rollerbacks? Yes, rollerbacks. Okay, sweet. Speak of the devil, I mean. We do more tear damage while in stealth, so let's stay hidden. Is there two of them? Yeah, I just want their tails, and then I think we're gonna get out of here. Turn around, buddy. Okay. I think I got it. Yeah. Oh, these guys are so cool. Nope, he's behind me. Yeah. I missed. Yeah, these arrows are expensive, man. 13 machine muscle. Ow. I'm just poaching you guys. Give me a minute. Oh my god, I missed again. Okay, well, I think we just needed the one. <laughs> Let's get going. Ew. Goop. I cannot hit that tail. <laughs> what is going on?
for the life of me. One more arrow. If we don't get it, we're, we're giving up. I'm bad at this game, guys. <laughs> there we go. Just gotta knock it off now. Sounds like Minecraft lava. Oh, he slowed. Maybe we can get it off now. Nope, he's still going real fast. <laughs> Game? What are you... What's this about them being slowed? Okay. <laughs> I mean, might as well kill him now, right? Oh, he's down. Okay. Uh, no, he's not. That's a glitch. I'm gonna leave the other one, I think. I just wanted the tails. Let's go. You didn't see that. <laughs> Missed every one of those arrows, I think? Only four? And I, I think I already have all the perks for crafting more ammo. That's kind of rough. They are really good, though, so it makes sense. Shearside Climb. Is that, like, a new area? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, no, no, it's a, uh... Oh, it's a settlement right here. Hold up. Oh, I'm so excited for, like, the, the wintry aesthetic. It's my favorite in games. You swing like a at the harvest. We're gonna get some amazing views. Okay. Uh, well, we got those tails, so I think we can upgrade something. Yes, our our hunter bow. Thank God. And I think that fang that I got last episode will let us do another one. Yeah, dreadwing metal fang. Which otherwise, I don't know what a dreadwing is, but I don't think we'll see one for a while. Maybe. Okay, now we need Dreadwing again and Stormbird, which is going to take a while. But we got some, uh, some another empty slot and uh, more damage. Great. Let's just double check. Anything else? No, we need Shellwalker. Don't know where those are. Purge. We could do that, but it takes all my Stalker Stealth Generators, and we don't use it that much anyways, so I think that's okay. Cool. Well, let's see what's for sale. Oh, no weapons. The coils are cool, though, I will say. Yeah, alright. Let's keep going. Oh, this is beautiful. I'm so excited to be here. <laughs> We've been in the desert long enough. Look at that. Wow. Feels like we're right back in the mountains, like... The Rockies, specifically. Is that... is that, uh... Is it El Capitan? I, I say it with a French accent, El Capitan, but... 
Um, that's, I think that's that, right? Let's check the map. It's gotta be. It looks like it, anyways. Which means the famous tunnel view is, like, that way further down the valley. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's a crit. That's fine. Winter Paleberry Shrub. Oh, it's for food. Can we... That must be Stonecrest, right? Yes. I think we're going to ditch the mount now because I just want to appreciate this on foot. Wow. Look at that valley. Sorry, guys. This is really pretty. Just, uh, ooh, fire. That's new. Yeah, let's take him out. Get his launcher off. What's that behind? Oh, it's a grazer, I think. Lancehorn. No. Firefang. That's what they're called. They're all the same, really. cannot wait to override these guys and mount them. I don't use mounts very often, but I'm excited to try this out. Oop, sorry, buddy. Okay, good. <laughs> Mercy kill, I guess? I don't know. Alright. It feels like we're right back in the cut, really. Oh, this is the, uh... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are cool. I think it's the same sound effect as the Scorcher Mine Launcher from the Frozen Wilds. Speaking of which, there are Scorchers in this game. I need their uh, parts for my next upgrade. So hopefully we'll see some soon. This would be a fitting location for them, right? Because it's so similar to Frozen Wilds. Let's leave them. Fanghorn... Stone crest. Okay, great. Hello. Beautiful settlement. This must be stone crest. Up on the side of the mountain like that? Katoa should be waiting for me. But maybe I should look around first. No, I definitely want to check out the uh, the merchants. Oh, this makes me want to see the Banuke guys. Although, you know what? The Tanakh um, have been a suitable replacement, I will say. Definitely vibe more with these guys in the Desert Clan, that's for sure. And not right now. Let's see, before we go talk with Hakaro. You know, I haven't checked a cook in, like, hours of gameplay. Shearside Mutton, huh. I really should, uh, investigate the food. It could really help. Hello, hello. Bellow Blast Spike Thrower. I haven't used a Spike Thrower yet, so... Yeah. Okay. I do need the trade, so... <gasps> Guys! That's gotta be the Golden Gate Bridge, right? <laughs> no way! We're getting close! Oh, wow! <laughs> no way. Amazing. This valley is infested with Regalus rebels. The scouts from the village tell us that they've been moving machines through here for days. Some they ride, others they herd along, and some they even strip for parts. Especially cannons. Mm-hmm. The path ahead will not be easy. We should get going. My orders are to guide you to the bulwark so that you can speak to Dakota. For all the good it'll do. Not so fast. I'm gonna need a little more than that. Yeah, he seems a little bitter, but honestly, I understand. What is this place? It's 
Stonecrest was built as an outpost, back when the clans were still at war. Its purpose was to guard the entrance to the valley, as well as keep watch on what happens below. And for now, that means keeping watch on Regala's forces. I wish we had enough soldiers to do more than just look on. For all the good it'll do? What's that supposed to mean? The bulwark has stood unyielding since the birth of our clan. Behind it, Tecote believes himself to be invulnerable. If he insists on defying Hikaru's orders, an outlander and a maimed marshal aren't going to change his mind. Italy can be Your convincing. Your chief seems to think differently. And that is the only reason I am still standing here, talking to you. Ish. What makes you so sure Takote won't listen to us? A snake safe in its lair hears nothing but its own rattle. Come on, is that all you've got for me? Hikaru said you were from the Sky Clan before becoming a marshal. I need to know what you know. Takote is a petty, vindictive schemer. Great. If he had any guts, he would have gone after Hikaru long ago. But instead, he covets the chiefdom from behind the bulwark, biding his time, hoping that his foes will weaken one another. Is that enough for you? <laughs> for now? I mean, no, we're still asking questions. What makes the bulwark so impenetrable? It's made of massive boulders. Impervious to any frontal assault. No army or machine has ever penetrated it. I am the only thing that can get you inside. If we're done talking, that is. It seems like the blue and the yellows is the color of the marshals and the chief, maybe. Why do you think Regala's forces are driving machines through the valley? We've heard similar reports from across the clan lands. The rebels are gathering machines from the wilds, but whatever control they have over them doesn't seem to last. So they herd them into camps. Something else happens there. Something... Something that makes their control permanent. Interesting. An override with two phases. Yeah. I... Don't know about that. But it gets worse. We've heard rumors that the rebels are scouting larger machines. I don't know what kind. I mean, we do. <laughs> Emotional material. Uh, I mean, technically, in lore, our overrides also aren't permanent, unless it's a mount. But you were at the embassy. I was. I'm sorry about the other marshals. And their deaths will not go unpunished. <clears throat> You're still healing. I will never heal. Hmm. But that won't stop me from cracking any skulls that need it. Good thing you're on my side, then. <laughs> hmm. Okay. I mean, I do like him, and um, I have a lot of sympathy. He's just understandably a bit bitter. So, what's the plan? The bulwark is to the southwest. So undoubtedly we'll have to cross paths with Rogala's troops along the way. We'll either have to fight our way through, or find a way to sneak past unnoticed. Neither will be easy. Never is. <laughs> Let's get this over with. Okay, so we're following him, I guess, right? Me. 